This is our third Maker Fair. It's the first one outside of California. The two previous have been in the San Francisco Bay Area. About three years ago, we started a publication called Make Magazine. It's a quarterly, and it features do-it-yourself projects. Simple idea was, we're kind of about technology, but a really broad sense of technology, not just the iPhone or, you know, what your computer is. And we just had, I just had the idea that, wouldn't it be neat to talk to makers about the things they make and they could show it to you, and what a great conversation that would be. So that was the original simple idea of a maker fair. Living on the Edwards Aquifer, we got to be really careful about how much water we use. And, and when you uh, wash your car, you use a lot of water. Science. I would always have these dirty cars, and I, you know, who, who can resist a dirty car window? You got to go up and do something on it if it's just, you know, to write "wash me" or draw a smiley face or, or something like that. Neat about it, the light bulb will work after this is done. She blinded me with science. She blinded me with science. You're almost there, folks. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a 4,000 pound stage. Good, yeah, this is the life-size mousetrap. It's 32,000 pounds, and I thought of it when I was a kid. And I decided in 96 to go ahead and start building it. It's going. It's going, folks. Yeah! Why, why do we always put the wrong ball in there? It's clown air. So the mousetrap weighs 32,000 pounds. There's 11 folks. Individual sculptures connected through kinetic energy, through springs, through triggers, ropes. And we balls. have several other sculptures and bowling balls and seesaws and class one levers and the whole works. Yes! <laughs> Become a DocuBlogger. Log on to DocuBloggers.org to share your opinions and story ideas, or get out your camera and create your own DocuBlog.